if you want to keep your team accountable, it's really, 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 really simple. You just bring up this board on the Monday and you bring it up if you'd like to on the Friday as well in those meetings. And that's how you do your check-in. You check in with these projects and then it will be each person's responsibility to check in on their area of business or their area of responsibility. And you can use any task management app for this. You could use Trello, Rike, Monday, ClickUp. Doesn't really matter your flavor, but here's an example of how I might choose to set this up. So I'll set up a new, I just set up a new blank project here and I'll just call it strategic priorities. And I like the board view for this, but you can switch between them in Asana, which is pretty cool. Side note, Asana is free for up to 15 people. So don't worry too much about the cost. You can you can get this done in the free plan just fine. And it gives you some recommended kind of like columns here. I'm actually going to update these to some other ones. So first column I'd probably create is business as usual, right? So that's like all the basic stuff that's not really related to a quarterly strategic project, but is important. So you want to track it. So business as usual stuff can go there. So next up, this quarter projects, right? And then you would do this financial year. So for us, it's financial year 24. Usually I do this based on business area. And then we have one for future quarter slash ideas list. And then finally we have completed because we need to put some, some stuff somewhere when it's done. So what I then do is I populate the areas of business, marketing, sales, delivery, team slash HR. We call that one empower. And each of the strategic projects that might be like, or themes that might be like over the course of the year would go within these. So within finance, we're probably going to have like one task for bookkeeping slash accounting, right? That's just going to be like an ongoing task. And that's going to run for pretty much the whole financial year to June 30. And I might assign that to Regina. There we go. I might even decide, okay, Regina's the head of finance. So give her that whole area of the business to manage. And then we've got some quarterly projects that we want to get done. Let's do another one in marketing. No, let's do it in quarterly. Okay, cool. So the quarterly project might be launch new website, right? Cool. Okay. And let's say Kai is responsible for that one. And that's due at the end of the upcoming quarter. Now within that one, within that project, we're going to have a bunch of subtasks, right? Get design done, copy completed, approvals with management, right? Email to database, right? All of these just become subtasks, which can have their own assignee and their own due date and all those kind of things. And it's due at the end of the quarter. Now, if you want to keep your team accountable, it's really, 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 really simple. You just bring up this board on the Monday and you bring it up if you'd like to on the Friday as well in those meetings. And that's how you do your check-in. You check in with these projects and then it will be each person's responsibility to check in on their area of business or their area of responsibility. And they can say, okay, Here's my percentage of progress on this project. It's either on track or it's off track. I've got some more advanced guides. And if you join Concierge, we can help you to implement this. We can help you to set it up. That's all easy to do. This is less, less about the tech, but if you've got more questions about that, I can create more in-depth videos for you on that. So if you would like help, I already mentioned Concierge. If you want help with any of the tech stuff, any of the build out, let us know. If you would like help on the business side of things, on track is a private mastermind program. And you also have access to private consulting with me as well. If you would like that, we've built a pretty awesome community of business owners. It is completely remote. So it doesn't matter where you are in the world, you can join, but we actually help you to build these things out and give you the guidance on how to run your systems on a business level inside OnTrack. IT Genius is really great on the technical level. OnTrack is on the business level. If you still have questions on this topic, drop them down below in the comments.